we are walking to the post office and we're using our phone as a tracking device. Hi there, this is Kat from Steps by Katja and welcome back to my channel. This week I'm gonna walk to the post office because last week I made this little route uh, with rootube.com on my computer. If you haven't watched that, check it out. I'll put up the link here and now I'll show you how I use this on my phone and use it as um, a tracking device. Okay, let me show you. We start with opening the app. That's the Osmond. There we have to go here in the left hand corner. Okay. Left hand as well here in the corner. We'll go my places. We go for tracks. And here you have the folder Ubik. And underneath you can we will find the route we made last time. This one. Okay, let's open it up. And then we want to start walking it. Okay. Let's start walking. So I'm moving in the right direction. Yes. Okay, here I have to walk straight. All right, and here we'll turn right I have to turn left here okay have to turn left here. Okay, let's cross this road. Be careful. I have to turn left now. And then a bit further down, I will have to turn right. That will be here. Let's turn left again. Okay, we go left. Another left. We are arriving in the village. So now let's turn left and then right again made it to the post office five kilometers down two and a half to go We came from left, now we'll be going right. I have to take that little path next to the little chapel there.
We are crossing the street. Then I want to show you what happens if I go in the wrong direction. So I'll be going straight instead of that way. So he just noticed I'm on the wrong path and he tells me to go back. Let's do that. Let me tell you something about the Osmond app. It's an open system map and you can get a free version of it and therefore you get 10 maps, which is already pretty good. But like France has at least 20 maps to cover the whole area. So you might get the paid version, but it's really cheap. So just look into it. I think you won't regret it. I love that because you can also use it as a GPS for the, your car. When we were in the States in 2015, we used it just as a car GPS and it worked really fine. So look into it. All right, we turn right here. Almost there, only a bit more than 500 meters left, and we did 7.6 kilometers. Okay, guys, we made it back. As you can see, we did about 8 kilometers. So I'm gonna stop navigating, just tap, and then you see here underneath, you can just dismiss. And dismiss your route. Yes, dismiss. Now I want to save my route. So I tap here 8.18. I set I say save current track. I can give it another name if I want to. And then if I want to show it on the map, open track. We can see what we did and how this all worked out. So this was it for my little walk to the post office. I hope you enjoyed walking with me and that you learned something from my GPS on my phone. And I'll see you guys next week for something else. Okay, bye.